Hi guys, welcome back to Life is Strange. This is the second part of episode one, or my second episode of episode one. I have moved my webcam to top right now because I didn't even realise I would be blocking the subtitles, which is clever of me. So, when we last left off, everything was a bit weird. We found out that we could reverse time. Fuck off, you stupid. We decided we fucking hate her. Bye. Even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. No, I need to go save that girl so she doesn't get shot. Oh, somebody got shot in the last episode. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. No, I'm not avoiding. Leave me alone. What do you have? Biding time, waiting for the elusive right moment. Exactly. Yep. Max, don't wait too long. I won't. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Cause this guy's just full of it, isn't he? Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Okay, so my last action was here. Start in the shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your. Excuse me. Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? So we still did yes. this last time. Excuse you. No, Victoria. And it was fine. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars. Bleh. Hurry up. John Lennon said, "Ah, ha, ha." I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Max, you're on fire today. All the right answers. Go ah. Ahead. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. Feel like them two are banging, but he kind of. Wants to be my friend. Let's go, 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 go. Uh, I was gonna say her body is blocking the open door thing. To the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. Oh, sorry. They'll think I'm crazy. Sorry, sorry. Pardon me. Yeah, we know. Excuse me. Pardon me. Here we go. Okay, Max, retrace every step. So what do we do? Splash the water. I washed my face. Yep. I shredded my photo. Then the yep. butterfly, butterfly around the side tape picture. And I took a photo. Yep. And then shit went mad. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I now am. Now what? What do we do? Hit him with the mop? You get that? What are you doing? Fibo! Yes! Fibo! Browser, it's happening again. I need a hammer to break it open. Quick! Hammer! Blech. More trouble for this than Move. drugs. Nobody would ha! Oh look! A hammer. Ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Fuck oh, sake! Holy shit! I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. You retain facts and inventory. Okay. I'm so sick. So of still trying to control me. You are going to have hella more trouble for this than drugs. No way. Don't there we go. He already had the gun out. Right? I thought I might have to wait. Now how the fuck am I gonna get out? Uh oh. Another shitty day. Ha! <laughs> you suck, bro. You suck. That did not happen. This cannot be real. But seriously, I just saw a girl get her. shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Carfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. Yeah, dickhead. Listen to your boss. Oh no. Go Bigfoots. <laughs> but don't we need to leave anyway? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm... Just a little worried about my future. Well, you're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? 
Well, Max? Talk to me. No, leave me alone. Report Nathan, hide the truth. Nope. We ain't saying shit. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? Damn it! It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. I feel like this wasn't the right There's answer. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. Shit, um... I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Oh, fuck off. Now get outside with class. Please. Yeah, say please, bitch. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. Right, try again. You look a little Let's just like Nathan was being a twat. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I yep. was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. And yeah, we had one that. of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. Well, yeah, because you weren't in there. So Wait, what I happened see next? It. Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. I just Thank go for you no. for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Try speaking don't again. around here. Get on outside. Fine. Fuck off. Right, I'm choosing that. Fuck it. I want that guy to die. Because he's a dick. I like the uh, art style. It's pretty cool. How come there's all the four students? Shouldn't everybody be outside? Oh, there was a squirrel! I saw Nathan it! Please come to the front office. Hey. Yeah, I know there's missing persons. Maybe this will twig Rachel her. Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Oh, I was waiting for her to be like, let's rewind everything and go back. But that's like three months or something, isn't it? Well, that's nice. Tits out. Why not? Let's have that for a picture. Good plan. Oh, tab. What? Oh, hang on. Sorry, I had a toggle hotkey. Whoops. Episode one. Eh, where were we? Journal. Journal? Journal? Let's miss. Ah, there we go. Dad. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still a little girl. Check your account down below. Ooh, monies. Who texts me? Warren. Okay, so... Hmm? What's going on? Fucking hell. Right. Do you want to meet me after school? I need an excuse to not study. Please make sure you check out Nick Romantic on my flash drive. What? Hey Mad Max, let's bust shit up. Wait, I have to study for a physics test, so if we bust anything, we have to measure its velocity. Don't ignore this message. Hi, Mooks. Can you check my flash drive? I need some info and space. Hello. Sorry, running late. Insane day. I'll meet you in the lot. Looking cool, you'll see. My camera will be ready. See you shortly. I hope so. Oh, he so fancies her, and she's just like, no thanks. Cool, so these are all the people we've met. Mad Maxine. Cool. Okay, anyway. I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Why do I have it anyway? Shit, where are the dorms? Oh, press tab again. Oh shit, there's 12 pages. Um, ooh, okay.
God, she's written in it already. Um, <laughs> it's weird. Yeah, I had to change my um. Oh right, dormitories this way. I had to uh, change something because one of my bandy cam buttons is tab, and it said press tab, and then the thing came up and it was really bad. But at the end, hi, Mr. Magpie. Where's your wife today? Oh, there she is. Did I turn off the subtitles by accident? I need to go to my room no. and return Warren's flash drive. Which one's her room? I'm confused. Oh no, we don't need to look at that. Prescott dormitory. Oh yeah, because Nathan Prescott... Ah, oh, okay, so... Nathan's family paid for the dorm, so that's why they're not going to do anything. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. Mark, she's definitely trying to bang him. Sir. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Don't I need to go in that door? Since you know what? all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Kick her in the head, kill her. Okay. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. Paint? So I like don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way. Sprinkler! I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. <laughs> right, let's find the sprinkler system thing, because I'm assuming that's what I need to- Ah! Do it! Dickheads. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this! Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You Not look a lot, great. it looks stupid. I can't even chill on the steps. Ah. Fuck you, man. Fuck you. Let's go and tell them to fuck off. They're gonna know it's me. I'm gonna get smacked. So do you understand English? Get lost. Do you understand English? Get lost. Well, now what then? Oh. Ha 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 ha. I feel like I need to do something with the paint. No, maybe not. Um, now what? Uh, um, Sorry, no paparazzi. She allowed. looks like a pissed off wet cat, and she's still stylish. What now? She looks like a pissed oh, off wet it? cat, and she's still stylish. Maybe there's something else in here that we need to look at. Anything? No. Whoa, whoa, what? Right. There's only one way around this. So paint first. Like I said. Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. How the fuck? So, I have to do something with the paint. Okay, I'm gonna pause it. Do you understand English? Till I know what the fuck Get I'm lost. doing. Okay, so I had to rewind a bit far further. I can't grab that. Samuel is way too close. There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. Not far enough still? Oh, hang on, this... where is he? Okay, he's not looking. Do it now. Tamper with it now. Hey. 
How are we doing that anyway? Okay, let's see if this works. What does she do? Hmm. A paint bucket next to Victoria. I see a plan. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of what the What did she do? I didn't even see what she did. Oh, is that why they were like, oh, she's wet but still stylish. They, so what they meant was... She's wet and still stylish. Find something to make her look unstylish. Please. Oh, she loosened that. Close, no cigar. They have to be right under the bucket. Okay. None shall pass. Capiche? Victoria is not getting the hint. Shit. Close, but no cigar. They have to be right yeah, under the right. bucket. Do you understand English? Get lost. Can I like fuck with her bag or something? Oh no, further back for this. Right, so. Fuck with the paint. Okay, let's see if this works. Nice, bro. Turn sprinklers on. So she has to get up and be like, oh my god, I can't do it. Because then she'll get up, and then hopefully they'll be up there. Look at this. She'll be up there with the pain. Just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Okay, well, did that work? Stay there for one more second, ladies. Yes, they should be stood there now. Yes, stay there. Boom! Fuck you, man. Oh, Samuel, sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Oh, he seems sweet. I think hold they're on, being dicks. Hold on. We'll get some towels. Ah, fuck you, Don't man. Let me in the dorm I next got. time. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Yep. Oh, I hope Max, uh, Max. I hope Samuel doesn't get in trouble, though. Take picture. 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 Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I want to take a picture. Picture! Fuck off. I'm not being her friend. Dickhead. Don't, Don't say a word, man. I want to take a picture! Yes! Yes, dickhead. And no filter needed before I post this. <clears throat> now please move. I've had a messed up day and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. Yeah. So does Nathan. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to get to my room, then see Warren. No, fuck that. I'm keeping it. I like that decision. She's a dick. I'm assuming that the actions will have consequences meant that I could have comforted her instead. And it would have been a nicer outcome, but fuck that, man. Fuck bitches, get money. That's what I always say. What the fuck does that say? Red bum. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. Taylor. We took so long. Taylor is a slave. Oh, they've gone to get stuff. Nope, not mine. Missing person's poster again. Stop him. Stop. Oh, stomp him. Bigfoot. Which one's mine? Nope. I do not live in the showers. How about this one? Don't be a zombie. They live. <laughs> oh. Nope, not mine. Well, bang for Jesus. Ah, there we go. Max's room. Oh, why haven't I written anything on it? How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Write something. It's sad, like you said. Teddy Bell. Hi. That's cute. And a guitar. I like her already. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. Um, oh, no, no, no. Flash drive. Flash drive. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Oh, Dana's got the fucking post-it. Uh, post-it. Dana's got the flash drive. Hey, girl, I borrowed your drive so I can watch the flicks while I study. If you need it back, just track me down in my room. So now I'm going to have to go to her room because she's got it and I need it. Great. 
Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. But anyway, I think I'm going to end this episode here. By yawning. I think I'm going to end this episode here. I will see you all very soon. Thank you very much for watching. Bye, guys.